What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So last week we gave you an Evo 9 wagon. I'm giving you the other Evo 9 wagon because they're just, just they're too sick to not, to not show you. Now this one's super low kilometers, um, but let's roll the intro and then I'll take you for a little spin around it. I heard they checking for me, no one checking on me, so I had to go run up a check. I got the message on me, ain't no flexing on me, my attorney gon' call and collect. Blessings on blessings for me, my successes only made them envious, they got upset. I had to put all their egos in check. I want the money, the power, respect, and I heard you know so and so, you not a threat, cause I really know so and so, they like my family, so they go pretend that they cool till they bust at your motherfucking chest. I'm getting. Alright, so like I said, this one is super low K's, it's under 100,000, I think it's about 95,000 K's, so this one is a little bit more expensive. I think they're asking 35, 36 for this one. Both of them are compliance, they're ready to go, you can buy them right now, which that's the hard bit right now is getting compliance on some of these Japanese cars. So if you want to get into one, you want something like this, maybe you want a bit of a family wagon, but you want a bit of JDM style, this is, I reckon this is where your money should go. Let's jump in that engine bay and I'll show you what they got. But first, this one doesn't have coilovers, stock suspension, aftermarket wheels, uh, stock exhaust, so this one is a lot more factory, but like I've said in previous videos, sometimes that's what you want. No one's tampered with it. You can just do whatever you want to do. There we go. Fairly factory, little pod filter, nothing crazy. Exactly what you want as a little base to start your own little project. This thing's beautiful. You know the power the Evos can get, but it's just in a wagon form. So you just got best of every single world. Cool styling. You can put your dogs in the back and go for a rip. Let's jump inside. So we've got some little extra gauges up on the dash. Sorry about the focus. Aftermarket head unit. This thing's nice, this thing's real nice. Again, full um, Recaro racing seats in the front, and you've got the matching Alcantara and leather suede in the back. Real tidy, real clean, and yeah, under 100,000 Ks. Now, guys, I would love to take you inside and show you a bunch of the other cars. There's a bunch of crowns, uh, 171s, 186s, 206s. Um, pretty sure there's like a, a chaser in there or something. There's a whole bunch of stuff, but we can't go in there because uh, just legal purposes. It's just a storage unit, so I'm not allowed to take you in. So when they get compliance, things like that, and they can actually sell them, then I can probably take you in and show you around. But these Evo wagons are sick. I'm, like I said in the previous video, I didn't know they actually existed, um, but they're dope. Like really, really nice, really comfortable. Could definitely daily this every single day and have a really good time. So guys, I'm, I'm hoping that you enjoyed two Evo wagons. I had to show you both of them. Both all black, both beautiful. One, yeah, 33K. This one's like 35, 36K. So if you want to be jumping into them, give JDM HQ a buzz. I don't make anything out of this, guys. This is just me bringing you some cool cars and uh, helping these guys out because they're, they're champs. So guys, I hope you liked it. Please like, please subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. See you guys.